live for that. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna say that your opinion is wrong because it's an opinion. Because opini opinions can't be wrong. I mean, I'm however, I disagree. I mean, I'll let you know. It's it's very subjective. All right, so we got crits versus nubby. I really like that type nubby. <laughs> nubby. <laughs> that's really funny. <laughs> think are you really gonna hit him with a nub? Like, do you, are you just gonna play a character that has small hitboxes? Like, just, just a little nubby. I don't know. A little, little nub. Maybe he plays Roy. Nubby. He's gonna hit you with a nubby sword. Yeah, a little nubby. <laughs> then we got Crits. I think Crits is the one with the blue hair. At least that's what that he, sign. He, he's points probably to. trying to still evolve his far fetch. Most likely, you know, he he needs three crits in a single battle to go ahead and evolve into surf fetch. So is that how that works? Yes, it actually does. I, I wish I was messing with you. A, a lot of the Gen 8 Pokemon have some weird evolution requirements. I'm with it. Mm -hmm. All right, so crits on the Lucas and Nubby on the Mario. That's Nubby. That's a Nubby character. That's a Nubby character. See, see the little, little, back, little neutral air on yeah. the feet? Back air, not so Nubby, but, you know. Right away, I'm liking the movement from Nubby. He's being aggressive, kind of occupying the space that Lucas is not comfortable in while still playing a little bit safe. I mean, he's really attempting to go ahead and do that, but Crit's understanding the fact that, you know, if I just space out just outside of that range, I can do quite a bit. And I think the biggest thing in this matchup is going to be that Zare. The disjoint on that snake is very difficult for characters with nubby hitboxes to get up in there. True, true. Yeah, man. And that Zare, definitely one of Lucas's better zoning tools along with the PK Fire. You know, specifically against Mario, the PK Fire can be really, really good because if you cape it, it doesn't reach all the way back towards Lucas, I don't believe. <laughs> Barely off the mark with that forward air. Forward tilt gonna find his own mark. Crits with the dash attack. Has Nubby right off stage. And oh, I like Super Jump Punch actually canceling out the PK Thunder. Yeah, and I like holding down there as well, just challenging him, saying that you're not doing anything safe right there. I'm just gonna hit you for it. It's scary. scary. Ooh, I like gets that. That's a little tricky, though. I mean, the down tilt combos and shenanigans can carry him so far. Well, it was actually a really good cancel off of the flood. Trying to bait him to try to approach. Uh oh, that's a double jump dude. It's okay, he just can go far. I, I never doubt any of the PK kids when they're trying to recover. Yeah, I mean, if you know someone's got the angles down, it, they just never miss. Up tilt, not gonna do it just yet, but gets pretty close. Yeah, it looked like he got a weak hit of that, but hey, nonetheless, stock's still gonna be online. Down tilt. Is it gonna confirm anything now? He's just a little bit too high over there. We have it the grab and the back throw coming out. Grits now putting the disadvantage. W trying to push this. If he can take the stock here, he's in a good position, but it's hard to edge guard Lucas like that. Yeah, no, I mean, really against Lucas, you just want to go for that ledge trap. He has so many options to try to get back to the stage. It's either you ha have to preemptively interrupt the Zare, or you have to get in front of him when he's trying to use PK Thunder. Yeah. It seems like Dubby, like, whenever he has a read of something, he just goes for it and only covers that one option. Like, he doesn't cover any other options. So My I man's I fully committed. Why yeah. do you think he got the wedding outfit on? True, true. I'd like to see him kind of take his time a little bit more, though, uh, react to something and just... Uh, Make sure that he's doing his due diligence on the coverage. But that back air finally going to do it. Take that first stock from Fritz. Oh, and eventually, it will go ahead and land. But there we have the neutral layer. Shield poking right past that shield. Nubby getting an answer. Up throw, down air, solid damage. And it's still going finally getting the air dodge as well. Oh, I thought he was going to back air. Try to look for the upper. Possibly looking for a roll. You never I like, know. I like the patience, though. He's chilling. He's waiting. He's seeing what his opponent's going to do. Now I mean, he brought it take... all the way back at that. Yeah, end. yeah, definitely. He lost that first stock super early. Jumping over the PK fire, not gonna get caught by it this time around. Okay, using the bat instead to get around it. Yeah, I mean, I think that's one of the greatest pulls that Mario has when he's trying to come back from above in disadvantage. Like, that that fireball, even though it may not do a lot of percent, but it leads into so much. One yeah, forces you to either to try to, you know, defend against it yeah. or put up your shield. There's a lot of set play to it, you know? And so whenever Mario fireballs, it just forces you to choose something. And then once you have to choose that option, you know, if Mario is good, they can cover a lot of different options as well. And then you just get into mix-up after mix-up after mix-up. Yeah. I mean, it, it definitely just turns into a conditioning tool at that anyway. Like, if, you, if he expects you to continue continuously put up that shield, or continuously try to hit it with the bat, yep. you know, the Mario can be like, all right, cool, I'm just gonna jump over you and catch you instead. There's gonna be a quick up B. For some, we've kind of seen that. Just like a panic, like, scramble up B, that was weird. I like it though. Right, he's gonna do another one right there, getting back onto the stage. Nubby sitting at 168 after the PK fire. And Crits is really just trying to seal up this stock, does not want to fall 
two behind. And this is a rage Mario too. This is scary if he gets put in the air like this. Just like this. Up e oh, okay. I mean, I know the up not gonna kill me, you know, that's just guaranteed damage right. that you're gonna want at 181%, but he wanted to go for the home run instead off the border. Yeah, you take whatever you get right now. I don't think you worry too much about the kill. Really get already. Wow, oh. we got weak F till. There's a lack of grabs coming off from crit. Like he's looking okay. for these PK fires instead, or just like just trying to get that safe option to get the kill. But finally, the toe is gonna find the mark. Yeah, Porter, really, really good kill option. I'm surprised that he hasn't been like kind of looking for it too much until right then and there. Okay. Nubby just being super aggressive with these back airs, not giving crits any space to breathe. There's gonna be oh, held down. Cave him. Oh. Uh, yeah, Kate, the forward smash the Kate would have done it, I think. <laughs> yeah, I think he expected uh, Crits to fall down a little. Okay, he mashed, he mashed. Oh my goodness, Crits is a legend. <laughs> what an amazing comeback for him. All he needed was that one PK freeze, put him off stage. Put that's his ledge. Oh, man, it's his, his ledge. You're not taking it back. You're not allowed. It's banned. Mm -hmm. Wow, hey. man. What a, what a way to go. Yeah. You, you know, I like how he came back so hard. That the music died. Yeah, what happened? Every, everything's just gone. <laughs> it, was, it, was just hey. like, it was just so good of a comeback. It was like, all right, everyone stop. Pay attention to me. See what's popping. Crit's getting a crit in his own right. True. True. All right, man. Game two. If I'm nubby, I'm not too sad. I mean, I'm, I'm upset about the loss, but I'm not too sad about the way that the game went. You played well. You kind of just lost on that last stock, that interaction. Uh, was what did it for you. You just have to be a little bit more cognizant of that in the future. I mean, he just took advantage of the opportunity that was in front of him. He's like, all right, cool. You didn't mash hard enough out of my PK freeze. Now you're off stage. Now you don't have a way to get back. <gasps> Not again. Not again, again, bro. Not again. Do it again. Hit him. <laughs> <laughs> you saw the down smash work last time. Just do it. Bro, Chris is actually like all over the edge guard. Like, he's only looking for okay. edge guards right now. Okay, that was actually slick. The down angle on that forward toad actually keeping Mario completely in place to follow up with that grab, too. This is Kritz's stage, dude. You're not allowed to come back. Mm -mm. Oh, I like the F-Smash. That would have been big. Would have taken the stock. Yeah, unfortunately, not going Woo. to land it. Another forwarder going there on the is. line. Nubby was not ready for it. Not the best DI. Definitely not. It's a Nubby DI. Okay, Nubby going for the home run. You gotta, you gotta go ahead and relax off those, because you know what? If Fritz go, goes ahead and does another one of those down smash, stealing that ledge, you're losing your stock very early. Yeah. Absolutely. Ooh, that's damage. 74. Yeah, he's, not, he's not gonna kill him. Yeah, this, this is, is not Ness. Yeah, since that, since that last game, Nubby's just kind of falling apart. The momentum is all in Fritz's favor right now. All right, telling this kid to take a bath real quick. Oh, what? Did yeah, both, both of them are just whiffing there now. There's a get up attack. Get off. Yeah, using the invincibility to go ahead and get onto the stage. And the option coverage. Because oh, he turned him around. Because Nubby is like holding in, he can cover the drift before the air dodge comes out. And then when the air dodge does come out, he can just cover the air dodge afterwards. Down there, still not going to do it. But on that last interaction, I think Nubby thought he was playing someone else that didn't have a disjointed grab. He was like, yo, I'll smash on shoot. I'm safe. They, they can't grab me. We're good. No, not, not against Lucas. That's the snake going to catch you real quick. Yeah, definitely. Crits working on a three stock. Let's see how far he can go ahead and take this. There goes his air one more time. Coming in with another one just to go ahead and recover this time, though. These weak hits are killer for Nubby. He just really can't find this. The, the weak hits for Kreds are working out so well. Yeah. They're just setting up so many tech chase situations. Great weight on the recovery with the tether. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Goes back in. Oh, he recovered high. He almost got hit by that down air. There's going to be back air. That's going to do it for the first luck. Nubby, maybe this is what he needs to get the momentum back in his favor. Oh, no, let, me, let me get a JP real quick. All right, never mind. That never didn't happen. That didn't happen. We're good. This is, this is Mario. Yeah, both the of them are No, I mean, they're playing shield chicken real quick. Yeah. They, they know that one big hit will go ahead and decide the set, possibly. I mean, the momentum's starting to shift over to Nubby now. Nubby. He gets a big F smash to the ledge. That could do it, but this is scary. He air dodges? Yeah, he got right the on Q, he's not going to get it. Using the cape stall. Uh oh This is a bad situation. He commits the double jump early. There's the cape. He's OK. Down tilt, down tilt into the F tilt. Yep. That's it. Crits taking it 2-0. Yeah, you from can't, you can't do nothing with that. It, from what seemed like, you know, something that was super 
in Nubby's favor. The way he was playing, he was so aggressive. Crits can 